Did I bore you? Is yeah. that it? <laughs> I was sleeping during the first <laughs> session, so we started with yes. And what what, what does this represent? Heart yes, heart. a closed heart. What does a heart need to be open? Safety, to feel safe. And then we went into, I'm totally blanking because you're putting pressure on me. Sorry, we've done this like a thousand times. So we know that to create safety, right? What are two ways that we can do that? The first one is this represents. Yeah. Yeah, cherishing, right? Seeing, seeing that value that, that's there. And then the second one. Yeah, and then you can't just think about your spouse in valuable ways. You have to nourish, nourish them and treat them in valuable ways. And we know that conflict is going can create a lot of disunity, those mm -hmm. power struggles, and that feels what unsafe. And that's that's not what we want. And then we all have. Yes, and when they are pushed, what happens to our heart? And then what do we do? We go into react and we either fight or yes. So how do we then deal with that? So do we work things out first as a couple? No. Why do we not do this first? Because it's it, it's tempting, isn't it? Because we want unity, we want connection. So this is tempting to power through this stuff. But why is that a bad idea? Yeah, because your heart's closed. Does, do good things happen when our hearts are closed? No, usually not. So just, just even if you're somehow good at that, just don't do that. Just, just do what? First of all, get your what? Your heart back open. How do you do that? Time out, and then what? Name what you're feeling, and then. Great, you're both open, so then you come back together.